Oxy Fuel Gas Welding Gas welding is a welding process that melts and join the metal by heating them with a flame caused by a reaction of fuel gas and oxygen. Oxy Fuel Gas Welding employs several types of gases, which is the primary distinction among the members of this group. Gas welding is a most important types of welding process, it is done by burning of fuel gases with the help of oxygen, which form a concentrated flame of high temperatures. This flame directly strikes the weld area, and melts the weld surface and filler materials. The melted parts of welding plates, diffused in one another and create a weld joint after cooling. There are three types of gas welding process which are, 1. Oxyacetylene gas welding, 2. Oxy gasoline welding, 3. Oxy hydrogen gas welding. The most popular gas welding is oxyacetylene gas welding, because of its high flame temperature. We shall be discussing on oxyacetylene gas welding. The oxyacetylene gas consists of oxygen and acetylene. The properties of oxygen are colorless, odorless, tasteless, support combustion and increase heat. While acetylene is colorless and has a very distinctive odor, it is also highly inflammable. Working principle of the oxyacetylene gas welding process is as follows. The oxygen and acetylene gases will be drawn from their respective cylinders mixed in the torch body, so that the mixture is processing certain high pressure. When these high pressure mixture is passing through the convergent nozzles, the pressure energy is converted into velocity energy and coming out from the nozzles at high velocity. The initiation for the burning of this mixture is given, the continuous flame is produced and the heat available in the flame will be used for melting and joining of the plates. Two stage reactions of acetylene and oxygen, first stage reaction, inner cone of flame, second stage reaction, outer envelope. Based on the amount of oxygen taken from the oxygen cylinder, the flame produced in oxyacetylene gas welding is divided into three types. They are, neutral flame, oxidizing flame, carburizing flame. Neutral flame. The ratio of oxygen to acetylene is equal to 1. The inner and outer cone is distinguished based on the color. That is, the inner cone is red or yellowish, whereas the outer cone is a light blue color. Maximum temperature equals 3260 degrees centigrade. The neutral flame is used for joining and cutting of all ferrous and non-ferrous metal except brass. During the joining of brass workpieces, the zinc present in the weld bead will be getting evaporated, and only copper is left over in weld bead which is not giving required mechanical properties of the weld bead. Oxidizing flame. The ratio of oxygen to acetylene is equal to 1.15 to 1.5. The maximum temperature is 3380 degrees centigrade. Because of an excess amount of oxygen supplied from the oxygen cylinder, the amount of oxygen to be taken from the atmosphere is reducing. Therefore, the mixture is burning within a short duration from the tip of the nozzle. Due to the high average temperature of the flame, high melting point metals can be welded easily. Carburizing flame. The oxygen to acetylene ratio is 0.85 to 0.95. The maximum temperature is 3040 degrees centigrade. Because of the short supply of oxygen, the flame has to travel for larger distance to completely burn. Hence, the loss by convection and radiation will become considerable. Due to this, the maximum temperature is only about 3040 degrees centigrade. Advantages of gas welding process are as follows. Most commonly used for joining of high carbon steel. It can adopt different jobs at a time because of the presence of strong flame. It is portable. Disadvantages. Because of the low average temperature of the flame, high melting point metal cannot be joined. This flame cannot be used for ferrous materials, because when a short supply of oxygen is given, there is a possibility of free or unburned carbon present in the flame, which is absorbed by the iron and increase in brittleness of the weld bead. 